too damn big. Come in, Anya. Do you read? William, they read you. What's happened? You okay there, darling? I'm doing... Ah! Fine. I'm trying to regroup with Fergus. I've contacted Grace. The U-boat is on its way in. And we are on our way to Lakeview District. Listen, don't do anything reckless. Now you stay safe. I'll be fine. Anya out. Horton, what's your status? Rounding up the last of the people and fixing to leave. You'll make your way to the Lakeview District. Bring everyone. We're getting over here. Well, Billy, that might be a fine idea in theory, but I reckon all them Nazis between here and yonder might slow us down dearly. Wager I can get their attention. Everyone get on board the U-boat. 
The Nazis will regroup and attack. Hurry up! Laskowitz, get your ass up on the Lakeview apartment building roof and climb on board the U-boat. We've spotted the outsmerzer on the radar. It'll be here any minute. Haul ass! the evacuees are on board, but we can't leave. Props are stuck in the mud. We're stranded, and the outsmercer is incoming. If it gets here before we bail, we are fucked. I say it's time to ready the nuclear cannon. What are you talking about, Fergus? I figure the shockwave from the atom bomb could push the boat out to sea. Now that's the stupidest fucking plan I have ever heard. Set. Well, for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Blazkowicz, hop on the nuclear cannon and fire it to maximum distance. I just hope it's far enough away from us not to rupture the hull. Looks like the Alsmercer lost track of us. Clear skies on the scope. Friar Angle commands it now. Using the taunt terrorists. But in the way back, the Alsmercer would roam from city to city, crushing any resistance. And if we ignite a revolt, you can be sure the Alsmercer swoop in, put an end to it, break and say hell's bands. If we're gonna start this revolution, we need to put an end to the Alsmercer firstly. So then we mount a surprise attack. Conquer the Ausmercer and use it against the Nazis. Now, the Ausmercer is protected by an automated security system called Odin. Seen it when I was up there. 
We'll hijack the system, find the olden codes, and disable the fucking thing. Yeah, but that kind of information is a top military secret. Only the Oberkommando is privy to it. Sounds like your basic Nazi facility infill. I'll break into the Oberkommando and steal the information off their uh, computing machines. Not a problem. Except for the fact that the Oberkommando is now on for Venus. Venus? Ever since you obliterated the Oberkommando at Roswell with that nuclear bloody warhead, the Nazis have been trying to shove the shite back into the horse. So, they moved the Oberkommando to another fucking planet to keep it away from us. All of their top brass, all their top military secrets have been moved to a fully secured base on Venus. Venus. There is no way you are making it to Venus, sunshine. I don't care how mighty your arsenal or how much fucking manpower. There is not a hope in hell you can bypass all that security. Yeah? Not with that attitude. Except maybe there is. In two days, final auditions for the role of the infamous terrorist William Terribilly Glaskowitz take place on the enigmatic Aristat habitat on Venus. One of the hopeful actors is Jules Redfield, here getting a snack from his favorite milkshake bar in his hometown of Eagles, California. What you thinking, Anya? William and I are going for milkshakes. are all in his glove box. Yeah. What about him? Well, is he a Nazi? You a Nazi fella? <laughs> Can't even tell no more. How I look? Like a walrus. Don't forget your luggage. Remember, you are Jules Redfield, professional actor. Traveling to Venus to audition for the part of William Joseph Blaskovich. Now, you are summoned by personal invitation, so security should be minimal. Break a leg. Mr. Redfield? Mr. You, Sir Redfield? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's me. I'm Helena, the director of this film. Apologies for the long journey, but my producer favors a safe location and has an affinity for dramatic settings. Uh, come. Oh, uh... Mind my luggage. Someone will bring it for you. Come, come. Welcome. Welcome to the audition, Mr. Redfield. Now that you're all here, I ask you to prepare yourselves. You must be off book for this audition, so be sure to memorize your lines before the producer... a volatile disposition. Be careful what you say and do in his presence. Mr. Redfield, I can't stress enough how important it is you learn's heart. Your script is on the chair. Be with you shortly. Can't blow my cover. Better keep a low profile. Leave the pretend acting for those so inclined. Your agent got you on the short list? Short list. Nah, no, man. I'm echt. The casting director that saw me on the show. Thought I had the right face. This is exciting. Man. Well, are Venus those stars real? Yeah, no, it's a little weird. But, you know, why Venus? It's going with LA. Just How am I supposed to remember this shit? Must go to the I gotta write this down. Yeah. Any stage experience? What was your name? Roland, was it? Ronald. Ronald. Nah. I used to do uh, broadcasts uh, when I was younger. Nowadays, it's all pictures and TV. Yeah, I thought about doing film acting, but I just love the theater. I'm not sure I even want this role. It's not like real acting unless you're on a stage in front of a live audience. You know what I mean. Sure thing, Chief. Unbelievable. Murder your dirty race. I will murder your dirty 
dirty race, too. Oh, come on, Johnny. Hey. <laughs> Better than this. <clears throat> I'll murder. Oh. <clears throat> I will murder your dirty race. Too. Oh, Jesus, you moron. Places, places, quickly! <coughs> Hi, <Hide> Hitler! <coughs> Hi, <Hide> Hitler! <coughs> Würden Sie mir bitte verraten, wer in Gottes Namen das ist? Ja, ja, es sind Schauspieler, mein Führer. Schauspieler? Ja. Äh, diese Männer wollen für die Rolle von William Josef Blaskowitz vorsprechen. Es sind Schauspieler. Es tut mir leid, meine Nachricht hat sie wohl nicht erreicht. Was? Und besser konnten wir nicht finden. Keiner von denen sieht dem Kerl auch nur ähnlich. Ja, 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 das kriegen wir. Oh Gott, noch mal. Das kriegen wir mit Schminke hin, mein, mein Führer. Oh ja, Schmeck. Mhm. Gut. Das ist magisch. Ja. Magisch. Magisch. Schauspieler. Geschult in der Kunst der Verkleidung und der Täuschung. Ja. Ähnlich wie Spione. Vielleicht ist er ein Spion unter Ihnen. Sie haben sich ja gelesen. Oh, yes, mein Führer. And my children have read it too. I loved it, Mr. Hitler. Super good. Mr. Hitler, wenn Sie mich ansprechen, sagen Sie mein Führer. Verstanden? Haben Sie keinen Respekt vor Autorität? Ihre Worte gewähren Einblick in einen höchst verraterischen Geist. I am so sorry, mein Führer. Sind Sie denn ein Idiot? No, mein Führer. Sind Sie ein verkleideter Schurke, ein Jude? Ein verräterischer Jude? No, no, mein Führer. I'm... I'm from Arizona. Ja, sie kommen immer wieder. Wölfe im Schafspelz. Konspirierende, lügende, stige Juden. Ich erkenne sie schon von Weitem. Wenn Sie mein Buch gelesen haben, wissen Sie, dass ich die Wahrheit kenne. Und wer die Wahrheit auf seiner Seite hat, der gewinnt immer. So konnte ich die Welt von den Juden reinigen und so konnte ich die minderwertigen Kommunisten in die Knie zwingen. Oh, so ging das. Ich habe ihn vernichtet. William oh, Josef Platzkowitsch. Oh. Oh. Ah. Helene, mein absolutes Meisterstück, das Jahrhundert Epos und mein künstlerisches Erbe. Wer mein Drehbuch liest, der wird die zahllosen Stunden zu schätzen wissen, die ich aufgewendet habe, damit jede Szene, jeder Zeile, jeder Silber fehlerfrei ist. Bravo, mein Führer, bravo! Oh, um Gottes Willen.
and you 